Okay, now this is why we need, uh, there's a misconception here, or some people don't understand exactly what um, multi-monitor support, multi-view support in Microsoft 2020 is. Some people think that it's just NVIDIA surround is what we need. No, it's not. We need multi-view and we need people to go on to Microsoft the forums and vote for multi-view. So uh, comparison between this and prepared with multi-view. And uh, so anyways, this is um, this is what you see. Uh, as you can see, I have three monitors. Um, I got it stretched. I don't stretch it all the way. The reason I don't stretch it all the way is because it just it looks even worse and because I'm stretching the it it, it uh, doesn't make any difference and it's much harder on frame rates so anyways but I just keep it like that so it doesn't look too distorted but as you can see everything gets messed up and look at the size of your your pillar there it's the size of a mountain and then, and then this one here too oh boy that's it's pretty bad but uh, I mean this is Langley Airport here but uh, let's get started and we'll um, take off and then we'll just do a, a quick flight in this and then we'll do a quick flight in prepared 3d so you get kind of get the general idea of uh, and I, I've, I've flown out of Langley Airport before and well it's it's not this hilly <laughs> but anyways as you can see is see it's your your image is really stretched there You know then okay but it's still it's still really look at how long your door is your door is like 20 feet long you know it just keeps on going and going and going so one thing I do like is you can get this view here so I mean that looks I mean that looks pretty good you get your get your hood right there and when you have a cockpit like 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 mine with three monitors this is a motion platform six degrees of freedom
multiple monitor support. You gotta look at your dash. Look at your dash. It's all all messed up. But I mean, you can beat the graphics from the front view, but from the side, like it starts to get stretched. Flying with one hand is not easy. So this is prepared version 5 and uh, this is what you see out of your left wing that's what you see out of your right wing and that's your cockpit view
see your runway. Line it up and come in way too steep like I am. And there you go, and I crashed. So, um, after those two videos, um, if you want to go and vote, uh, we do need you to vote for multiple screen functionality. So go to your forums, go to self-service, wish list, and multiple screen functionality and click on the vote. As you can see, I already voted, and if you have already voted, it says remove vote. So I already voted for this. But, um, you know, you, you, you wonder, like one of the top things uh, that beat multiple screen functionality by three or four times was um, remove the press any key to start. Uh, that was the top thing. And of course they, they fixed that, but really that was the most important thing uh, anyway, so we need your help. Everybody, please go to multiple screen functionality. The old saying, squeaky wheel gets the grease. Well, we got a real squeaky wheel, so we need to be greased up. So, uh, yeah, please vote for multiple screen functionality. And, uh, yeah, we kind of need this before we get world updates done. Uh, yeah, pretty fancy scenery is nice, but... Really? We can't wait another two years for this. Thank you.